up to 14k. Possibly saw some puffins, though uh, there might have been two other species that occupy the island. I mean, the problem is they're so far away that even with binoculars, uh, they're quite small and hard to identify. Um, I went up to uh, Jenny's Cove and then down the west side of the island, so I've pretty much walked on all the major footpaths now. Uh, collected quite a few more of the letterboxes. The sun's been out all day, so e even with uh, sun cream, I got a bit a bit sunburned. Just nose, the back of the neck, and everything. Uh, dinner is being cooked at the moment. Uh, sausages. And, uh, we're, we're trying to basically cook everything we've got in the fridge because we're going tomorrow. Uh, we're going to be out at ten tomorrow, but the boat arrives in the afternoon. Uh, for us, and it leaves around six. So we we have a, another full day. I think. Spend it mostly on the uh, letterboxes down this end. So we've got one of the lighthouses there, one of this island, which is called Rat Island, that you can get to at low tide. Uh, apparently, the box is just below the summit there. I don't know how the hell I'm going to get up it, but uh, <laughs> we'll see. Um, so yeah, it's been really fun. Uh, it's, it's very barren. Uh, past the midway point. soil here, uh, with quite, quite regular looking grass, to uh, ferns, tufts of grass, and moors, and, you know, peaty areas, it's, it's quite a, uh, stratific uh, friends, me, a stratification of different geologies, uh, with all the granite and slate, and, you know, but yeah, uh, I'm going to go now, because this video is being completely pointless. Uh, oh, have a look at some boats. They arrived uh, an hour or two ago, and the uh, the crewmen boated to shore. Uh, 